The Dutch Caribbean island of Curaçao is a popular vacation spot due to its stunning beaches, thriving coral reefs, and relaxed way of life. Not too far off the coast of Venezuela, it is one of the ABC islands together with Aruba and Bonaire. The tropical island displays a fusion of European and Caribbean elements due to its colonial past with the Netherlands and its current status as part of the Netherlands. And that is why in this video, we will tell you about the top 10 places to visit in Curaçao. So watch the video until the end. Before starting, like the video and subscribe to our channel so you never miss our future videos. And now, let's get started. 10. Rifort Village Rifort Village, located at the entrance of Street Anna Bay, is one of the greatest spots on the entire island for shopping, dining, and nightlife. Many tourists from the neighboring cruise ship terminal make their first stop at the enormous waterfront mall, which features a wide variety of stores and eateries. A vital part of Willemstad's defenses since 1828, the Rifort has seen more recent service as a brothel, prison, and police headquarters before finding its current purpose as a trendy shopping center. There are dozens of high-end restaurants and one-of-a-kind shops lining its thick coral walls, as well as chick pubs and happening nightclubs. 9. Mambo Beach The entrance fee to this beach is $6 per person, however, it is well worth the money because the beach itself is so beautiful. Not only is it stunning, but it also has all of the amenities necessary for a fun excursion, such as shops, eateries, and resting areas where one may enjoy a refreshing beverage. You can take advantage of the exciting nightlife, unwind at a soothing spa, and shop to your heart's content. Mambo Beach offers a wide variety of enjoyable activities, so if you are looking to swim, soak up the sun, engage in water sports, or simply unwind, you won't run out of fun things to do there. 8. Punda Four distinct neighborhoods make up the capital city of Willemstad. One of these neighborhoods is called Punda, and it is often regarded as one of the most beautiful areas in which to go sightseeing on the island of Curaçao. Punda and Atrobanda are both located on opposite sides of St. Anna Bay. Punda was founded in 1634 and constructed as a walled city at the time of its founding. Willemstad is also the location of the Curaçao Synagogue, which holds the distinction of being the oldest synagogue in North or South America that is still in use. The core of this city has been recognized by UNESCO as a World Heritage Site due to the wonderful architecture that can be found there as well as the harbor access. 7. St. Michiel St. Michiel is a little fishing hamlet located along the coast, and it is home to a scuba diving club, hiking paths, restaurants serving seafood, and even a fishing pier. Fishing has emerged as the most well-liked pastime in this location due to the scarcity of sand that prevents visitors from enjoying a traditional seaside experience. Some of the best seafood on the entire island can be found in the restaurants in this town, including delicacies that were caught in the waters just outside the restaurant's front door. You will get the opportunity to visit a salt marsh as well as a path that features stunning vistas while you are here. This neighborhood may be found on the western side of the island, not far from Bulanbai Bay. 6. Stas Abao Beach The beach known as Kas Abao can be found on the northwestern shore of the island, not too far from the town of St. Willibordas. This beach is frequented by both locals and visitors. In addition to having picture-perfect sands and water, it also has wonderful beachfront bars, restaurants, and even full-body massages that guests may take advantage of throughout their stay. Its sparkling blue waters and bright white dunes, which look like they were plucked straight from a tourism brochure, make for some fantastic photographic opportunities and even better views. You have the option of sunning on the beach and gazing out over the nearby cliffs, or you can rent kayaks and snorkeling equipment and venture out to the area to investigate the cliffs for yourself. Casa Bao may look like a small slice of heaven, but there are sufficient sun lounges and umbrellas for guests to make use of. 5. Playa Porto Mari Playa Porto Mari, located just a little further down the coast, is another lovely option for beach course. It is well known for the friendly wild pigs and iguanas that inhabit the area, and its repaired coral reef is also a top snorkeling spot on the island. Its crescent-shaped cove, hidden between two rocky headlands, is perfect for swimming, snorkeling, and diving, and there's even a tiny dive store right there. After you've had your fill of the undersea treasures, you may have your pick of three nature trails that meander around the coast. 
Playa Porto Mary provides a beach bar with tasty Caribbean and Dutch food for visitors who wish to unwind and eat while they lounge on the sand. 4. Playa Manzanillo The water at Playa Manzanillo's beach is a beautiful blue and there is a generous supply of white sand. If you have a passion for delicious food, meeting interesting people, and listening to great music, you have no choice but to go to this beach. The water and the beach are popular destinations for sunbathing among both locals and visitors. Not far from the beach, visitors may also enjoy other activities such as riding four-wheelers and ziplining. Spending the day at the beach, or even just a few hours there if you have time in between visits to other tourist attractions, is a fantastic way to spend time at the destination. 3. Queen Emma Pontoon Bridge Willemstad's two historic districts are joined together by the Queen Emma Pontoon Bridge, which traverses Street and a bay between them. It is a delight to take a stroll around the area, which features spectacular panoramas of the brightly painted mansions and Dutch-style buildings that line the water's edge. The Swinging Old Lady was built in 1888 to connect Otrobanda in the west to Punda and Peter May in the east. The floating bridge, which is now surrounded by arches that glow in the dark at night, opens regularly to allow ocean-going vessels to enter and exit the harbor. Its overall length is greater than 500 feet, and it has historical markers at both ends that provide additional information about the well-known landmark. 2. Handelskade The magnificent Handelskade is unquestionably the capital's highlight location, located directly in the historic core of Willemstad. The wonderful assortment of colorful colonial houses, seen on almost every Kyurusao postcard, makes for some fantastic images and watching. Its instantly recognizable 17th-century buildings are painted in vibrant yellows, blues, oranges, and pinks, and look out over the gleaming waters of Stana Bay. Its vibrant beachfront, which is part of the Punda neighborhood, is now home to a plethora of cafes, restaurants, stores, and art galleries. Aside from roaming around and taking in the nice atmosphere and architecture, you may sit in one of the cafes and watch the Queen Emma Pontoon Bridge. You can easily explore the city center and see most of the city's major museums and tourist attractions from here. 1. Willemstad The city of Willemstad serves as the capital of the island and is home to a variety of attractions, including beaches, gorgeous architecture, and a bustling atmosphere. In addition to the many restaurants and retail establishments that can be found there, the riverfront is home to several colorful structures that serve to highlight the allure of the city. Because both the medieval town and the waterfront have been designated as UNESCO World Heritage Sites, you won't have to drive very far to uncover magnificent historical landmarks. In addition, there is magnificent architecture, such as the Queen Juliana Bridge and the Queen Emma Bridge, also referred to as the Swinging Old Lady, both of these bridges are in the city of Escondido. The majority of the island's southernmost portion is contained within this town's boundaries. Thanks for watching. If you want more videos like this one, make sure to like the video and subscribe to our channel to never miss out on any of our videos.